This is an important conversation. It is important to know that Thomas Jordan has been now seven years with the Swiss National Bank. Here is his conversation with Guy Johnson. I don't make any forecast on that, but if you look at the situation, of course, there is no reason to tighten monetary policy. Everything else, it's rather that the monitoring, monetary uh, conditions tighten somewhat, and we take that into consideration. Do you think you'd get, if you were to cut rates, and you, and you talked about the fact that you have the flexibility to mm. do so, and I don't think anybody is disputing that, mm. but nevertheless, do you think you would get some pushback from the financial sector? Is that what ultimately could limit the SMB's room for manoeuvre when it comes to, to kind of cutting rates further? No, we always uh, analyse the situation from the perspective of, may, of achieving our goals. Uh, we see what kind of insurance instruments are available, and then we make a cost-benefit analysis and make uh, the appropriate choice regarding uh, the instruments. But would you, if you were to cut rates further, would you expect pushback from the banks, from the financial sector, that they're not happy now, mm. uh, you're at minus 75, if you were to go lower, they'd be significantly more unhappy, mm. and I'm kind of wondering incrementally they would become more and more and more and more unhappy. Well, it's not our task to make the financial sector happy. It's our task to maintain price stability in Switzerland, to supporting the economy, and we are taking the decisions in order to achieve those goals. Okay. As you say, it's your job to, to achieve that. Do you think the Swiss people, do you think the financial markets believe in your ability to get inflation moving higher? Well, we are at the moment in the range of price stability. So the goal is to remain there, not to get back into negative territories for inflation. And if you look at uh, the last 10, 20 years, the track record is quite well for the Swiss National Bank. We always achieve to go back to the uh, to the, uh, range of price stability. So we managed the Swiss economy going through a very difficult period relatively well both regarding growth, but also regarding inflation and price stability.